Angelina engagement announcement. Advice or congratulations? Simply congratulations. Catherine Zeta-Jones and Michael Douglas will celebrate their 20th wedding anniversary in November. This quarantine has literally reunited their family, they said. Few love tales are as strong or convoluted as Michael Douglas and Catherine Zeta-Jones. Following two decades of health scares, scandalous rumors, and highly private difficulties, Catherine has revealed a surprising secret that has the world talking. She finally reveals what secrets. Did their once shaky marriage survive? Did something greater happen behind the scenes? The Taj Mahal narrative is about love. The man constructed it to honor his wife who died in childbirth. Join us as we uncover Catherine's announcement and its implications for the marriage. Beginning of Michael and Catherine's love. Imagine a Hollywood love story so true and passionate that it has withstood time, celebrity, and even scandal. A non-sparking romance is under investigation. All eyes were on its fiery connection. From the moment Michael Douglas and Catherine Zeta-Jones met, they were magnetic. A bond beyond attractiveness. Not just another celebrity fling, it started something lasting on common ambitions, respect, and loyalty. In a world of Hollywood romances that burn bright and dissipate, Michael and Catherine's connection sticks out. Theirs is distinct because of what they've been through together, not just who they are. They went through unimaginable trials as a couple. Name it, health issues, personal hardships, and media criticism. Yet, love has become stronger. What makes their bond unbreakable? What makes their love stand out in a world where others fail? We must start at the beginning of their story to grasp this. Be prepared for a roller coaster ride? Michael Douglas and Catherine Zeta Jones' romance is curiously Hollywood. When they met, it was like a script was written for them with every detail flawless. They met during the 1998 Doval Film Festival in France and fell in love immediately. Even though Danny DeVito, a mutual acquaintance, connected them, Michael took the risk. Despite their 25 year age gap, they were attracted. It was love at first sight for Michael. He instantly liked her and wanted her in his life. In an unexpected moment of confidence, he told her, I want to father your children. Although ridiculous, this demonstrated his undeniable attraction and instant desire to build a future with her. Catherine was intrigued, not put off. Being there is a treat since I've never gone. I've visited Venice, but not the film festival. Responses have been great. This audacity and Michael's appeal made their relationship electric from the start. She was curious. This man wasn't afraid to risk his heart. It was risky and crazy. It was just what she needed to hear. She was inspired by Michael's boldness and honesty, and their relationship flourished. Catherine saw more in Michael than a Hollywood celebrity. He was wise and experienced, understanding fame's pressures. Catherine gave Michael a fresh, youthful energy he hadn't felt in a while. Michael's calmness and Catherine's energy created a perfect balance. Their age gap may have made their relationship seem odd, but it was right for them. Everyone viewing their blooming romance was charmed by their sincerity and groundedness. These were two prominent actors. However, their connection felt natural, honest, and grounded. Despite their celebrity and glitter, they seemed to share a modest, real bond. Both stars and people were pulled to each other's spirits, not simply the romance. There was no doubt about their connection, and every hour together seemed to strengthen it. Their personalities accentuated their unusual relationship. Michael's calm, experienced outlook and Hollywood roots fit well with Catherine's new, energetic personality and mystery. Not simply fit. Complimentary. Michael admired Catherine's tenacity and independence. Catherine respected his wisdom and family devotion. Have you ever spent a night like this with your son? I love it. My family is really tight. His upbringing gives him this world, but he never lived in it. They admired each other's talents. More importantly, they respected one another as people. This mutual respect and affection solidified their friendship. From the outset, their partnership was based on devotion and dedication. They weren't only hooked on romance. They accepted challenges and disagreements. For Michael and Catherine, love was more than a sensation. It was. A promise to stay together through good and bad times. Their love tale exemplified stability, respect, and loyalty in Hollywood, where relationships sometimes end swiftly. Despite public scrutiny and fame's hurdles, their bond deepened as the world watched. Early on, they learned to defend their relationship from Hollywood demands. Instead than publicizing their romance, they nurtured it privately. This choice demonstrated their love went beyond the headline. It was genuine and important to them. Finally, the public saw that Michael and Catherine weren't simply another Hollywood couple. Their love appeared multifaceted. It was based on laughing, understanding, and friendship. They didn't aim for perfection. They learned and grew together despite their flaws. Fans are drawn to their love story because it's a rare peak of something lasting in an industry known for short romances. However, all relationships have ups and downs. Those problems can feel even bigger for celebrity couples like Michael Douglas and Catherine Zeta-Jones. Did you know the pair had a marriage problem that nearly shattered their wonderful relationship? Guess you want to know. Challenges in marriage.
the Michael Catherine bond appears like it's sprung from heaven, but their love story has moments that test it. In 2010, tongue cancer became one of Michael's major concerns. My early cancer was a one-two shot. It was likely dark. Michael and Catherine were shaken by this news. She worried about losing her beloved hubby. Anyone would be terrified by a health crisis. However, a celebrity couple may feel overwhelmed by the attention. The media covered Michael's condition and speculated on his treatment and recovery. Watching her spouse suffer was agonizing for Catherine. Catherine loved and supported Michael during this difficult period. She checked on him and encouraged him through challenging times. Michael later confessed he couldn't have survived without Catherine's help. Even though they loved each other, the tension strained their relationship. How? Despite his health issues, Michael made controversial comments in interviews, oral asterisk and HPV may have caused his cancer. The cause of his throat cancer is generating a cancer prevention debate. Michael Douglas says his throat cancer was transmitted in a new interview. He hoped to raise awareness about the virus and immunizations, but his statement surprised many. They sparked media and fan criticism. This issue also tarnished their friendship. People wondered if Michael's comments embarrassed Catherine and their family. That puts Catherine in a tough spot. She adored Michael, but public scrutiny was hard. She struggled to balance supporting her spouse and handling his criticisms. As many worried if this would be the final straw that would end their marriage, it was difficult. They worked through it together instead of letting it divide them. Catherine stood beside Michael, expressing her belief in him. Michael and Catherine knew communication was crucial. They shared their emotions and anxieties. Honesty brought them closer, allowing them to tackle their challenges together. Michael apologized for whatever discomfort his statements caused Catherine, noting how difficult it was for her to handle the public backlash. He matured by accepting responsibility, making it apparent he never wanted to hurt her. Any partnership needs this kind of communication, especially under public scrutiny. However, the couple's troubles continued. In 2013, they did the inconceivable. Breaking up was their choice. Many thought they were a great match, therefore this news surprised admirers worldwide. The separation was difficult for both. They knew they needed time apart to evaluate their relationship. Their time apart allowed them to consider what they wanted and how to repair their relationship. They reevaluated their life and marriage. Hollywood was shaken by Michael Douglas and Catherine Zeta-Jones' split. Many admired them as a perfect match with a beautiful love story for years. However, their split felt like a movie plot twist no one saw coming. Many pondered what caused this startling decision and if it affected them both. As in every relationship, things are not always as they seem. Behind the public front were long-standing issues. The strain of Michael's health concerns contributed to their breakup. Michael heroically battled and recovered, but the incident affected their relationship. Their marriage suffered from the stress and they dealt with the consequences differently. Catherine, a Hollywood star, struggled during Michael's sickness. Working and raising a child while supporting her spouse through a life-threatening illness was her challenge. The stress of these duties strained their marriage. Stress from a serious health scare can shake a relationship. One partner fighting for their life may overwhelm the other and leave them confused how to cope. They split because of Michael's health concerns and external influences. They were always in the spotlight as a celebrity couple. Every element of their lives is scrutinized by the media. Backlash from Michael's inflammatory claims concerning his cancer's cause strained their relationship. Catherine had to deal with Michael's public statements. One cancer isn't talked about enough in a society where cancer is virtually daily news. Like me, most Americans know little about oral malignancies, which are rising. This worsened an already difficult predicament. Catherine has said in interviews that media attention can aggravate personal issues. Constant monitoring made it hard to discuss their feelings and needs privately. They felt forced to provide a certain image to the public instead of communicating frankly. This separation can damage any relationship, but especially a troubled marriage. Michael Douglas also faced a serious claim in 2018. Susan Brody, a former co-worker, accused him of sexual misconduct in the late 1980s. She claimed misbehavior. In the 1980s, Michael Douglas' production firm employed Susan Brody for three years. Douglas repeatedly harassed her, she said in her first TV interview. Alleged difficult working conditions with him. Fan and media reactions were swift, and these charges threw a cloud over Michael's long career. Michael Douglas quickly denied the charges. He took matters seriously. He said he didn't recognize her behavior. He questioned the timeliness of these reports, which arose decades after the claimed crimes. Michael was deeply hurt by the claims. He was surprised and disappointed that someone would make such assertions after so long. He thought the claims were harsh and unexpected, and feared they would damage his reputation and family peace. His wife, Catherine Zeta-Jones, was also deeply affected by the charges but she stood behind Michael and expressed her disappointment. 
Catherine strongly supported Hash Me Too, which allows people to speak out against abuse and harassment, but she also valued fairness and justice. She concerned that unproven claims could overshadow serious malfeasance. Catherine's position was apparent. She encouraged everyone to tell their stories, but she believed accusations should be supported by evidence to protect innocent individuals. Michael and Catherine split amid these issues. Celebrity couple Michael Douglas and Catherine Zeta-Jones are apart. After some difficult times, they are taking a sabbatical after 13 years of marriage. Many couples benefit from stepping back to gain perspective. Fans were devastated by this decision. A couple that seemed so in love and committed would abruptly split up is a mystery. During their separation, Michael and Catherine assessed their life and marriage. They considered what had gone wrong and how to fix their relationship. Both were introspecting. Michael eventually realized that he had messed up their relationship and needed to accept responsibility. He realized he occasionally overlooked Catherine, wanted to apologize. Catherine also took time for herself. She focused on job and their kids. This separation helped her find her identity outside of marriage and motherhood. Both grew stronger during separation. That wasn't my dance experience, however good. My kid asked me, can I dance like one of her friends? I said, Lord, thanks, which made them cherish their affection. They realized their romance was worth fighting for. It appeared they had hope again. They resumed communication after a few months. The separation allowed them to discuss their thoughts, worries, and future plans. Michael and Catherine realized they still loved each other and missed their connection. They slowly rekindled their connection. Their reconciliation was difficult, but they persevered. They improved their communication and expressed their feelings without judgment. This growth was crucial to their reconciliation. Michael and Catherine stressed the importance of learning from their mistakes in interviews. They stressed that every couple has ups and downs, but how you handle them matters. The commitment they made to work on their relationship was vital to their reconciliation. Trust and connection would require time and effort to rebuild. They needed to demonstrate their commitment to succeeding this time. They committed to sharing their feelings and supporting one another. Michael and Catherine have said in interviews that reconciliation taught them about love and relationships. Michael and Catherine realized their love could weather their hardships as they returned to each other. They began to value family dinners and peaceful evenings with their kids. This mutual regard strengthened their bond. They prioritized their relationship since love demands care. Even in hard times, they knew their relationship was worth it. Their split shocked fans, but also changed their love story, showing the power of resilience and the value of cultivating a bond through life's hardships. The love that brought them together returned slowly. The flame that started their romance returned. Their moments together became about emotional understanding rather than physical proximity. This new relationship reinforced their family and individual bonds. Michael Douglas and Catherine Zeta-Jones' trial separation worked well. Reunited, they appear happier than ever. Catherine Zeta-Jones has made a comment that generates global curiosity and conversations as fans relax and enjoy their love tale again. She discussed her husband, Michael Douglas, his 1970s romance with actress Brenda Vaccaro. You think she revealed what? How does this affect their marriage? Latest Catherine announcement. Catherine revealed something unexpected about her hubby. Catherine also mentioned Michael's close relationship with Brenda, providing followers an insight into the past relationships that created the man she loves. Its story of love, remorse, and life's unexpected turns makes it compelling. Brenda Vaccaro was a prominent Hollywood actress when she met Michael Douglas. Their relationship was one of Hollywood's most talked about at the time. They were young, talented, and in love, a dazzling pair. Despite their deep connection, Brenda's reluctance to marriage ends their relationship. There was no lack of affection or commitment. It was more about their life options. Despite being intimately involved with actor Don Stroud, Brenda acknowledged decades later that not marrying Michael was one of her biggest regrets and confessed her love for Michael. After thinking about it, she concluded that not marrying him had ended their relationship. However, life carried on and they found love elsewhere. Michael marries Catherine and Brenda marries Guy Hector. Brenda has forgiven herself and respects Michael despite her regrets and his Catherine-centered life. However, Catherine's recent statements on Michael's past with Brenda have captivated people since they reveal her perspective. A wife who gracefully accepts her husband's past relationships is rare. Catherine understands how his past shaped the guy she married. This reveal illustrates Catherine's trust and confidence in their relationship, indicating her love for Michael stretches beyond the present. Michael considered Brenda a major part of his life. He was striving hard to get famous in Hollywood at the moment. Brenda, a renowned actress, was his early partner and confidant, probably thinking before you speak, being kind, kinder, softer nation, and civilization. It involves many things we should consider that have left our culture and way of life. They have many memories and a strong friendship. 
As with many couples, they had problems that led to their separation. Brenda's hesitation to marriage changed everything. She was not ready to marry, but Michael respected her wishes. Though they loved one another, their differing aspirations drove them apart. Fans are talking about Catherine's comments because it demonstrates a level of maturity and empathy rarely seen in the public light. Catherine values Michael's tale, including his predecessors, by acknowledging Brenda's influence. This transparency has earned their partnership praise because Catherine's regard for Michael's past shows true love and dedication. Catherine encountered obstacles in her relationship with Michael. Their partnership has been strained by health difficulties, public attention, and personal issues. Catherine's ability to see the larger picture and realize that every facet of Michael's life has shaped him has deepened their relationship. The video is over. How do you feel about Catherine's admission regarding her husband's past? Tell us in the comments. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Additionally, click the video below. You'll like.